My name is Miriam Woolley, and I'm a student researcher at the Center for Biomediated and Bioinspired Geotechnics here at Arizona State University. And today we're in our lab talking about soil erosion. There are different types of soil erosion, from water and wind to even human or animal caused erosion. And you might think that it's just a natural process, just let it keep going, but it can actually be bad. Wind erosion of soils can lead to air pollution, breathing in. You know those big dust storms that we get here in Arizona? Well, those are from wind erosion of soils. Natural soils have what we call a crust. They make the crust over thousands of years to reduce wind erosion of soils and other erosion types. But we don't have thousands of years. I mean, honestly, I'm going to be dead in the next hundred, so we need a thicker fix. And that's what we do here at the CBBG. We look to nature to solve our modern engineering problems. So today we're going to be talking about stabilizing the surface of the soil the bio way. So right now we're going to do a experiment using hydrogels. So what are hydrogels, you ask? Well, let's break down the word. We have hydro, which means water, and we have gel, which is a gel. Mix it together with water and you get a gel. So, what happens when you take dry sand and you blow on it? Fat! Okay. And that's why we wear goggles and masks. Safety first, kids. That could go in your lungs. Alright, so let's start this experiment. First, we're going to need small containers, either I like to use Dixie cups, and you're going to want to take a scoop of sand up to about three quarters of the way up, and we're going to have two conditions. We're going to have a dry, untreated sand, and we're going to have one which we add our hydrogel to. Just add one scoop of hydrogel on top of the surface, and then we'll dump water on both of our samples. seconds. This is our untreated sample. Water just came right out. And this is our treated sample. Nothing. Absorbed by the hydrogel. And when that dries, that will become a crust. Resistant to wind erosion, resistant to water erosion, happier and healthier for humans and the environment. 